Let's discuss now the energy diagram of butane. So if we indicate the energies of the different conformation as was discussed previously, so we have said that when the dihedral angle between two CH3s is zero degree, this is the highest in energy. So I will just put a mark in here that that's the highest in energy. Then we said for two eclipsed, the two other eclipsed conformation, which is the angle is 120 degrees between two CH3, they have the same energy and therefore I will put two marks in here. So I'll, I'll try that I'll have the two two same marks and now we said that the 180 angle is the lowest in energy so I'll put two marks in here one in here and one in here now for the other staggered gauche conformation we said they are more energetic than 180 but less energetic than uh, 120 so I'll put two marks in here Now, connecting these marks together, I will get I will get an energy diagram that looks like this. On this energy diagram, I have three eclipsed three eclipsed conformations and you can see that they are the most energetic ones and I have three staggered conformations and they are lower in energy You can also see that the anti is the least energetic. However, the gauche is more energetic than the anti.